Mr. Grantham to ring back yesterday. He did say I'd called. OK, just tell him I'd like to speak to him as soon as possible. Thank you. Problem? I reckon Michael Grantham's trying to avoid me. Businessman of your stature? Surely not. I could do without the sarcasm, thank you very much. Do I sense disharmony in the ranks? Oh, no, Carl's feeling unloved. Michael Grantham doesn't seem to want to meet him. Mike's a very elusive man, always has been. I've got close to doing business with him so many times, but we've never had the right project. I know. He'll be interested in my proposal if he'd only hear what I've got to say. He can afford to pick and choose. That's the trouble. Hi. Hiya. We can get the keys for Moor Cottage at lunchtime. Start moving in straight away. It'll have to be tomorrow. I've got too much on. Oh, come on. You must be able to spare a couple of hours. I can, and I start a new job today. Oh, you're moving on already? I've been promoted. Pollard's given me a managerial role. Oh, how exciting for you. Take no notice of her. I never do. Tomorrow it is, then. Right. Domestic bliss. How sweet. Yeah. Beats being on the shelf. James! Welcome to Emmerdale. <laughs> it's lovely to see you again. It's a pleasure to be here. I always enjoy meeting... The one who told me he'd ring back. He's in a meeting. Yes, you've said. Good news. I've had a word with Mike Grantham. He'll see you tomorrow. I've been trying to get hold of him all morning. I managed to persuade him. He'll be here at 2.30. Oh, aren't you moving in with Lexi, then? I'll see him. I could always see him instead. I said, I'll see him. You'll need to be on top form. I've wanted him on board for a long time. And he's got limited investment funds available. Hiya, oh, yeah. it's me. You know, you said you could get the keys for this afternoon. Well, yeah, 